London Fashion Week is always a celeb studded style extravaganza. But there's one show in particular that manages to attract more A-list power than all the rest. We hit the Burberry white carpet to meet some of fashion's most famous followers. It's one of the most high profile shows on the fashion calendar, with every stylish celeb worth their salt bagging a coveted invite to Burberry. But according to fashion powerhouse and Vogue editor in chief Anna Wintour, it's Irish designers who are having a moment right now. Well, I wish there were more of them, but um, there's a show on in. Uh, uh, New York right now called Once, which has been a huge success and uh, so I think there's so much talent in Ireland and obviously I think what Bono and his wife are doing for Idan is great and you know we wish we had more of them. One Irish designer who was well represented on the day was Louise Kennedy, with singer and actress Holly Valance donning a navy French lace dress by the Tipperary woman. But Irish talent aside, it was all about Burberry for Transformers actress and model Rosie Huntington Whiteley. It's so iconic, you know it was the first high fashion brand I ever worked for and they really put my career on the map and, and I've been here for four years it's like family to me so it's very special for me. Black Eyed Peas frontman Will I Am wore classic Burberry trench coat for the occasion while actress Kate Bosworth rocked an autumn winter look straight off the catwalk. French actress and gossip girl star Clemence Posey was also feeling the Burberry love. Um, I just I stole everything from the men's collection really <laughs> uh, but it's yeah it's all from Burberry. Burberry model and my week with Marilyn actor Eddie Redmayne took the opportunity to wish his co-star Michelle Williams the best of luck with her Oscar nomination. I had a wonderful time doing it. Again we, we, we were shooting in Pinewood in, in London. Michelle was in Marilyn Monroe's dressing room. It's a kind of completely overwhelming part to undertake and, and she did it with grace and I think, I, I hope she gets everything she deserves. Amidst all the designer action, heiress to the Topshop empire, Chloe Green was flying the flag for the high street. For us, I think Topshop, people like it for what it is and doing the odd collaboration with an odd designer works, but I don't think we need them. I think we're very good on our own. Inside the specially constructed show venue in Kensington Gardens, models showed off a selection of belted skirts and jackets in tweeds, wools and velvet, with autumnal shades like green, rust and rich brown taking centre stage. And we'll be checking out more looks from the Burberry runway later in the show.